Hey y'all, what's up? I just want to let y'all know that it has been one year since I got my braces. I'm real happy with how my bottom teeth are turning out. They're, they're getting straight the way I want them to get. And um, as far as my top teeth, I'm not real sure about the top teeth. The top teeth, they have not moved um, as much as the bottom teeth. But I think they did move some. I'm just not really you know sure about that. Uh, the, the top were, were not as crooked as the bottom teeth. So that may be why I can't tell. But um, the braces are correcting the overbite that I have. So I have an overbite in this either with my uh, the bottom teeth or the top teeth or one of those. I'm not really sure because I'm not the dentist, but I'm just trying to remember what, what they told me. So So anyway, I'm thinking that, you know, I'm getting an overbite corrected and that has to do with the top and the bottom teeth. So, yeah, and it's, it's been 12 months. So my progress is good and um, I'm surprised that I lasted this long because when I first got my braces, like the next day or probably even that same night after I came home, the braces, the, uh, the feel of the braces was uh, very annoying up under my lips. So I was uh, really uh, thinking about uh, taking a screwdriver or, or maybe not a screwdriver, but taking a wrench, some wire pliers or something and, and breaking those brackets out of my mouth. I mean, it was that serious. That's how I felt the first day after getting the braces because um, when you don't have braces, uh, you're not used to having something hard up under your lips. You know, your lips are tender, they're soft, they're tender, and you're not used to that. So when you get the braces on your teeth, that is the, the uh, main thing probably that's gonna annoy the heck out of you is the feel of those braces up under your lip. So that was, real, that was very annoying from the beginning. I could barely wanna keep my mouth closed. It was like I was trying to figure out a position to hold my mouth open where my lips didn't have to touch the brackets because, I mean, it was very, very bothersome. But anyway, it only took like a, a week to actually start to um, um, wear off where the brackets did not bother me as bad. So anyway... So yeah, and then probably after about two weeks, you know, I was probably good as far as the feeling of the brackets up under my lips. And so, like like I said right now, you know, I've been having them for 12 months. And I'm going to tell you, I'm, I'm almost used to them. I'm wondering, you know, how, I, how will I feel once they are, you know, as, once they're taken off and I don't have them. But anyway, uh, yeah, you know, I'm glad I kept them because... Uh, the feeling was very annoying up under my lips, so um, I really wanted to just uh, take it into my own hands and get a tool and just break them off my teeth. So what I did, I did a little Googling and, you know, to see how others were, were feeling about their braces. And basically, um, everybody else was saying the same thing, that the braces are annoying, you won't be able to eat, and you won't get used to them, and all that kind of stuff. But I did find that um, throughout this journey that I have um, been able to eat at times. It is a little struggle eating, but um, I've gotten better with being able to eat. So, And um, as far as the feeling um, of them being in my mouth, uh, I can still feel the bracket but I think I'm, you know, I'm more used to it now. I'm definitely more used to it now, so they don't bother me as much. And so I'm really, I'm really happy that I kept, that I kept them on because um, I really, really needed for my teeth to get straight. And um, you know, if I had given up then, then I would be still in that same position and I would be unhappy. And so now, as of today, you know, I'm, like I say, it's 12 months later, 
And this has been a struggle. I had to fight with the dentist a little bit, you know, here and there because some of the stuff that she wanted to do, you know, patients are hard-headed sometimes, you know, and I think that I, I'm the type of person, I'm not a good patient, okay? So that's the reason I had to fight with the dentist, you know, a few times about stuff that she wanted to do. But eventually I end up letting her win because I know that she's a dentist and I'm the patient and if I follow what she wants me to do then I will probably end up with the smile that I want, you know, versus the smile that I had, you know, anyway. So yeah, and I'm happy, like I said, I can't see progress after one year. And so I go back um, and I go back for another treatment and not until uh, February and so I just went to the dentist. Um, I went to the dentist probably, I think it was uh, December. It was December 14th. I'm just not getting around to uh, giving y'all an update on, on my braces because I've been real busy and I've been going through some things. But when I went to the dentist this time, what she did was apply what she calls um, a power chain. And um, it's just a, it's still, it's a rubber band that holds the, um, it holds the, the wire that goes across the bracket. It holds that onto my, um, it holds the wire onto the brackets. It's, but it's a, the, the bands are connected instead of individual bands. It's this one long band and, and, you know, she put it on there and it's called a power chain. The reason why it's called a power chain is because um, I guess it, 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 it since there are, it's one rubber band, it pulls together and applies more power in order to move the teeth the way she's trying to move them. So she's trying to close up some spaces. She just put that on the top. I didn't need it on the bottom, but she's trying to get the, the top uh, corrected um, also or whatever. So that's why she put that on the top. When I when she first um, when I first went back got my treatment um, I was feeling some annoying pain um, in my mouth and my gum my teeth it's like I could feel the pull the pressure and I could feel that for about three days at like always and then after that you know it's you know start feeling back normal again and so right now I feel you know pretty normal. There's no, no more pressure or anything like that, so. Yeah, I think that's, um, I think that's basically, you know, it. You know, because I don't want to talk too long. I know it don't, it don't take all that to uh, give you an update and let you know how I'm doing, but I'm just going to say that if you have braces, if you just got your braces and, and they really feel bad up under your lips and you're thinking about um, um, getting a, a tool, a wrench or something and breaking them off because you feel like you just can't take it, well, I'm going to tell you, don't do that. Don't, don't take off Yeah. Don't take don't take it into your own hands and remove your braces if you just got braces and you feel like you're not gonna get used to them. If you've Googled anything and they said that you're not gonna get used to your braces, then um, don't believe them. You will get used to your braces because I didn't think that I was gonna get used to my braces, okay? And so I did get used to them and you know, the doctor told me it was going to be like uh, anywhere from 12 to 18 months for me to wear braces in order to uh, get my teeth straight. And it's been 12 months already, so that means I have about six more months. But I'm not really sure, you know, um, if if I'm gonna if my teeth are gonna really be ready in six more months. But you know, I'm gonna see, cause every time I go back to the dentist, she tries something, uh, something new. Just when I think, you know, that I'm used to my braces, you know, the way, you know, whatever we're doing, and we go back, and she's gonna do something new, like this power chain thing. And then last month, you know, I, the last time before this, I didn't uh, update my, I didn't give an update because I, I did get busy 
I mentioned it in one of my vlogs, but um, I had she had me wear some rubber bands, you know, connected uh, from the top bra um, a set of braces down to this, you know, on each side. I had one rubber band. supposed to do but I had to wear that for a month so she didn't ask me to wear it this last time that I went so I'm happy for that and like I said I've just um she you know put this power band thing on her or whatever so um yeah so yeah so I think you know that's gonna end my update of my uh, braces for right now and um, I hope it was helpful to you if, if I um, if I said anything that was helpful to you then yeah well whatever so just gonna say thanks for watching and uh, be sure and hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed to me already and I'll see you next time deuces YouTube